Hey everybody, this is Buddy. Well, I'm back on my bicycle. I'm fixing to go for a ride. So I I, I wanted to stop by this, this right here where they're doing the move of the mill. And um, I can't go beyond this gate, but on the other side, coming back or later today, I might film the other side and what you can see from the bridge. But as you can see, they literally lifted that up off its foundation and moved it out into the road. And that's got my curiosity up I want to I want to check uh, the internet for anybody that was videoing it when it was actually lifted up process and moving on those rails that'd be real cool to talk about that and show that but what Johnny Morris I mentioned Johnny Morris in a video out west but I didn't say uh, top of the rock so that you know so now I'm saying if you've seen the other video Johnny Morris this is the kind of thing that Johnny does he he uses older things and makes them beautiful and so you can see all my videos on top of the rock and and what i've done with uh some of his his buildings that he's built out there on top of the rock he owns bass pro and if you ever been inside bass pro you everybody always wonders well how in the world did they get this big wood and all this look and all of that feel of that open space well, it's because Johnny's the innovator. He he really knows how to hire the right construction people to do the right thing. So it's going to be real curious to watch this develop over the time and the years. These are people that are working on it. All right, I'll get back with it and uh, I'll give you a follow-up on my first bike ride of damn I hate to say it but it's the I've been so busy since the first of the year this is my first bike ride since uh, I got back from Jamaica and let's see how far I can go today <laughs> all right well I just rode around here to the front side to be able to show you look at this that's you can see where the road dropped off how high that is and then how close literally they had to take some of the road out here to be able to maintain that levelness man I'd like to have been <laughs> on this project moving this thing I've seen some big things move when I was building paper mills and power plants but this is a unique one of them things only once in a lifetime of a career of a construction worker getting to move something as big as this and as heavy as that thing is I don't know how they estimated it but they over oversized everything just to be on the safe side can't really get a good shot of that area over there where the hoe is where the foundation is but you can see it from right around here but I can't get I can't get access to that side it don't look like but I'm gonna go over there next and show you what it looks like There's the bridge. There's my bike. Boy. Yeah. Well, I moved down here to this corner, and then I said, okay, I can walk right down here. And look, I got a good view. I thought it was going to be totally blocked off, but that's not necessarily the case. So as they put these footers, these foundations in and uh, drive piling to bedrock, I can actually uh, videotape the, the, the process. Well, that, that will be cool. Yep. And you can hear and see the water running right here. I hope he figures out a way to utilize that to turn power to make electricity. That would be really good to use hydraulic water. Well, you know what I'm saying, water. It ain't the it ain't the Hoover Dam, but it's good. I see a light on inside the building. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's on. All 
All right, that's my first look at this project since I got back in town. Um, of course, as usual, I'll be making videos about it and monitoring it. So, if you want to see what happens to the Ozark Mill, check back and you'll have the details as best I can get them. I'm going to try to actually get uh, a, a good idea from the people building it. Maybe even have an interview with Johnny Morris himself about this project. All right. I got to work my legs a little bit to get back into shape. At least I can make it to Rogersville. I don't know if I can make, I don't know if I can make it that far today, but I'll tell you how far I do go. But he's all grown up. Hey, buddy, buddy, buddy. I think he's one of them two right there. See him raise his head. Buddy, 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 buddy. Buddy. Well, I made it to Rogersville. And now I'm on my way back. So I come by the alpacas and looking at them. Boy, the trees aren't even budded out here like they were in Little Rock or Houston, Texas. Uh, we got probably another two to three more weeks just to catch up with them guys. All right, thought I'd show you Buddy. He's way off on the road. I can't get a good picture of him, but I'm pretty sure that's him. 